Today I'm going to show you four banks that all pay at least 5% APY on their CDs. And the CDs range anywhere from 6 months to 12 months. If you like content like this, please press that like button and subscribe. It really helps the channel. The first one I want to show is called Abound Credit Union. Now if you live in parts of Kentucky, you can sign up with this one in certain counties or if, if you know a member, otherwise otherwise you can donate a small fee of $10 to a particular charity and, and then they'll give you membership. But this one I like the best because it's the shortest one and interest rates are going up. And like for me, I, I would rather have this six month one at 5% than to be locked in at, at 5% when in six months you'll be able to get probably five and a half percent. This, this one has a $500 minimum, so you have to put in at least $500. And this is the best offer they have. If you look at all their other offers, they don't have anything anywhere near this high of a rate. The dividends are paid and compounded quarterly. For a account balances 10,000 or higher, dividends may be paid monthly. So becoming a member, if you're not a member of this uh, credit union, you can sign up on their website. This uh, credit union has 18 branches in Kentucky. To qualify as an Abound member, you have to be an employee or one of our select employer groups, living, working, worshiping, or living, working, or uh, worshiping, or attending school in Kentucky, in certain areas of Kentucky an active duty military reserve national guard or civil service employee retired military or civil service a contractor attached to fort knox army base if you're not any one of those you can pay you can pay ten dollars and and sign up and they'll accept you here's the sign up right here it says here i want to support one of the following military or veteran group with the ten dollar membership fee so if you if you don't want to select one of the other options you can select this one and you donate money to this group, then you're accepted. One thing I w I'm not going to talk about for these CDs is the early withdrawal penalty. Most likely they all have early withdrawal penalties because they're not they're not penalty free CDs. So more than likely, um, if you're gonna take it out early, you're gonna have at least a three month penalty, most likely or more in interest. So uh, if you're if you're actually thinking about taking it out early, I would I would suggest don't even sign up for the CD then because it's not worth it. Look for other options in that case. Basically, you're gonna have to keep the CD until maturity in order to get the maximum interest without penalties. The next one I want to show is from Capital One. It's a 5% APY 11 month 360 CD. It's a guaranteed return, no minimum balance. Lock in this rate by March 14, 2023. The interest on the Capital One CD is actually compounded. It's accrued daily but paid monthly. So you get monthly monthly interest on this one. It seems like a pretty good rate. I think I would still prefer the six month rate since rates are going up about quarter of a percent every month or two and within three months it's possible that it's going to be another half percent higher and most likely you'll see that the rates will will be higher for all these cds by then for example my wealthfront cash account is already paying me 4.55 percent and in two or three months if the interest rates go up around a quarter of a percent a month or a, a couple of rate increases like that in three months this will be at five over five percent and within three months and if it keeps going like that uh, you know in six months it could be um it could be maybe five and a half percent and you could sign up for this if you sign up for this uh wealth front and you do the 0.5 boost for three months you get basically four people you, you would get a whole year of the half percent rate increase for a whole year the next one is from bmo bank it's a five percent apy Certificate of deposit, it's a 12 month term. It has a $1,000 minimum opening deposit. This one, just like uh, Capital One, is a, a bank, not a credit union. So it's insured by the FDIC and not the uh, credit union authority like the first one. Okay, now BMO, since this term is 12 months, for CDs with maturities one year or greater, interest is compounded daily and will be credited to your CD quarterly. You cannot make withdrawals from this account until maturity date. The next one I want to show is from Umbrella Bank. It is a 5% APY 12 month CD. It has a $1,000 minimum balance required. FD, it's FDIC insured just like the other banks. All of these CDs are taxable. They're, they're federally taxable. So 
If you live in a state with state and local taxes, you may want to look at other options, but I'm, I'm in a state that doesn't charge any state taxes, so I don't have to worry about this other than the fact that this is going to be, this is taxed as ordinary income versus a, a dividend from a stock which should be qualified, which is going to be a lower tax rate. So uh, CDs aren't perfect, but for times when it doesn't get much safer than a CD and it's very stable and it's a good place to put your money, I will be doing a YouTube video coming up on money market accounts and you'll see that some of the money market account rates now are actually getting very close to this 5% rate now and so I've got about 10 options that I've selected so check check that video out coming up probably in a few days. Please feel free to like and subscribe and comment in the description if you want to see something else or if you have any comments about how I should do these videos differently feel free to comment in the description. Have a good one.